Good morning again, guys. Live again. Oh my gosh, it was my first Bath and Body Works in store sale. I've never gone in store to Bath and Body Works. So I thought I would share with you guys what I got, give you some feedback or give you some tips on what you can do, things that I did not do today. So good morning, guys. I will give you guys a few minutes to go ahead and join on back live again today. Went to Bath and Body Works. It was actually a lot of fun, but it's a totally different experience than just ordering online. So if you're an online person um, like I am, you know, it's exciting to get the candles, but there were a lot of things I should have prepped for that I did not prep for. So I'm going to share with you guys what I got in this haul. I'm going to tell you what I spent. I got a total of, I think, 13 candles today. Um, and I do want to thank if, Paula is here. She sent me the Bath and Body Works coupon, so I was able to use the 15 off of, I think it was like 40, so that was really exciting. I got every candle I wanted. So I am not a Bath and Body Works candle expert. Clearly not. I should get better at it. A um, couple of things. So my Bath and Body Works um, is at the mall, so I had to go to the mall. They had three security guards, so they had it all taped off. You had to go through this zigzag entrance, um, which they were very, they were excellent. They were well prepared. They gave you your little, you know, basket things so that you could do your shopping. Um, very well prepared, so they did an awesome job. And um, they were giving out candy canes, so it was, the line moved pretty smoothly. Um, but once you got in the store, it was hot as heck in there, guys. Do not wear a heavy coat if you're going. Oh my gosh. I went by myself. So a couple of tips is, number one, do not wear a heavy coat. It was like summer, the hottest day of summer in that store. It was so stinking hot. Good morning, Amy. Um, if Paula's here, thank you for the coupons, Paula. I did use them for the sale. I did not get the mailer coupons this year. Um, what other tips? Don't bring a purse like this. Don't bring like a purse that you have to hold. This barely fits on my shoulder and it like slides down. Good morning, Magical Monica. Um, wear like a crossbody purse. It's going to make it so much easier. And again, it is so hot in there today. It is so stinking hot in store. Do not wear a heavy coat. Don't bring in like a coffee or anything. Today is not the day to, you know, browse and shop. It's like madness in there. It's a great madness, but it is pure madness in there today. Um, I think you're gonna be fine. I mean, they were telling me how many candles they have like in back and stuff. So I know someone was just saying they're going after work at five. I don't think you're gonna have a problem unless there's something that's like super hot. I don't even know what are like your favorite candles, guys. I'm gonna show you what I got, um, but I wanted to tell you guys, don't wear a heavy coat in store. Don't bring any beverages in store. If you can keep the kiddos home, that would be good for you because it's just, you're just neck and neck with people. It's just so um, congested in there. It was like, that was the bad part. They did open up additional registers. They had four, like a station with four registers. So checkout was like 15 minutes. It was not a long wait at all. The problem was holding your tray of candles and oh, the fresh ball. I don't know if I got that one. Yes, be nice to your workers. They were amazing. I told them, you guys are doing an awesome job. They were so stinking hot in there. Cause like I said, that was one thing. It was like, a, just, it was so hot in there. I can't believe having to work all day. And most of them had short sleeve t-shirts on, but it was crazy. So try and leave the kiddos home. Don't bring a coffee and don't wear a heavy coat and bring a crossbody purse. Something that is gonna be easy. Um, to maneuver in store because you're holding those big old trays and it's a pain in the butt if you're by yourself. If your husband can come, if your best friend can come and they're not buying candles, utilize their strength and ask them to kindly hold your candles for you. That would be amazing. I wish, um, I got champagne toast. I, Monica, I love that one. That is my favorite. You carried a backpack. That is, a lot of people tried to bring carts from like JCPenney and Macy's and they weren't letting them in. 
I feel bad because it's it was really heavy. I had I bought six. I think the trays hold six candles. I bought thirteen candles. It was very hard to hold the candles to try and smell them. That's why I'm saying uh, my sister brought a wagon. Did they let you bring the wagon in? They wouldn't let anyone bring like any of the shopping carts from the other stores. So, but I'm going to start with what I had bought. I mean, a lot of these are for gifting purposes. Um, I wish I still had a stroller. I probably would bring a stroller. That's a pretty good idea. That would make it so much easier. I mean, it's hard because there's not a lot of room in there to maneuver it, but it would have been worth it for me to have a stroller. Um, but yeah, definitely be nice to all the cashiers. Tell them, you know, you're doing a great job because it's a stressful day for them and they are all pulling together and they're really working like a great team. So the first one I got is mint chocolate. This smells like mint chocolate. Um, I did have the hot cocoa candles for um, Halloween and I absolutely loved it. Um, so it smells, it smells exactly like mint chocolate. Oh, I'm seeing all of the candles. I wish, you know what, I should have asked you guys yesterday when I went live what candles you are getting today. And too, a lot of these are gifting ideas. We're going to um, like holiday parties. This is a great hosting gift. Um, so like my sisters were going to, so just to give her something, I'm going to give her a candle, but they have these really pretty bags. Don't forget to get your red ties. Um, my store had them when you left the store. They had like a um, table that you could go ahead and grab. Them. So let's go with the candles. Okay. I, this is not a Christmas candle. This is not a winter scent. It is watermelon lemonade. I'm sorry. That is my go-to scent. I don't care if it's winter and there's snow out. I love watermelon. It smells so amazing. Watermelon ice, sparkling water, lemon with essential oils. This one smells so stinking good, guys. Sugared blueberry donut. I didn't see any of those in store. Cereal marshmallow bar. That sounds amazing. That sounds so good. But yes, this is such a yummy scent. That one is for me. I like like clean, crisp kind of scents. This is eucalyptus mint. I like the ones with the essential oils. I'm an essential oil gal, so probably that's why um eucalyptus, eucalyptus spearmint lemon peel sage and essential oil so this is like a clean crisp kind of a scent it's not like strong it's not um you know crazy strong um mary mistletoe i just i love the way that these look they're so pretty this is frozen cranberries sparkling pear icy peppermint balsam branches with essential oils. So this one smells really good. It smells Christmassy. It definitely, it kind of reminds me of like a real tree, like the smell of a real tree. Um, okay, so I'm gonna pile these all on me. I love these tops. These tops are killer, guys. Look at that. Reuse your jars. Um, use them for like, I use these for cotton balls. So I clean out the candle really good. And I don't know about you guys, but Bath and Body Works candles are like super easy. Hello, Texas. Super easy to clean out. They're like no work at all. But this is my favorite champagne toast. I love this one. I can light this one and smell it throughout my entire house. And we have pretty tall ceilings. So that's kind of like amazing to me to be able to smell it like in my bedroom. What deal did I use? Um, I had got sent in the mail um, from a subscriber, actually, her coupons. Um, I used the, I think it was 15 off of 40. This is awesome, Monica, isn't it? Oh my gosh, this one smells amazing. That one is for me along with the watermelon for sure. I am not giving that to anyone. Hey, Karen, good morning. Coffee today, yep coffee there's in store oh gosh guys I got here late I was supposed to get here at like seven o'clock um I got here late because I had computer issues with that darn CVS in store video I love doing it some of the clips were just not working YouTube was not uploading it was crazy um I think even without coupons it's still a good deal guys check your emails see if they emailed you anything velvet cupcakes smelled very 
good. I'm not really like a foodsy type candle person. I like more the citrusy fresh scents, but that one smelled really good. This was the difficulty for me since I'm not like a regular Bath and Body Works. Like I have a few of my go-to. I love anything apple, um, not so much spiced apple, but like the candy apple. I love that. Um, with not being a pro, going into store today and trying to smell things was really difficult because I was trying to hold them darn trays and trying to see everything and it just wasn't working. So a lot of them, I just got like a quick little whiff and it was like, okay, I'm going to grab this. Now this smells kind of spicy, but it's the cinnamon. So I like cinnamon in winter. I like the cinnamon pine cones. They smell so good. We make our own. Um, with essential oils. This has a clove buds and nutmeg. So this is a very Christmassy scent and look at the super cute um, llama on it. Very pretty and it has like the snowflake top. I mean these are just great for the teachers guys. These are great little gifts to go ahead and give on a budget. I better take this tray out because I've got another one. And then of course a frosted cranberry. I love anything cranberry. Like my favorite scents are all always like red color, red in color. Um, so cherry, um, apple, cranberry. And this one smells really good. This could be a Christmas scent or, you know, this could be an after Christmas scent too. Ice cranberries, blonde woods, red apple, tonka bean. I don't know what a tonka bean is. But whatever it is, smells pretty good. So that is one of my trays, guys. I'm going to put these on here. So I've seen a lot of your favorites. There were some like really, who got strawberry pound cake? That was, I did not see that. So those must be like the hot, hot scents that you guys, that people stand in line for to really get. Um, will you be able to exchange them if you don't like them? So I learned a couple things about Bath & Body Works. Now, if you have the Bath & Body Works app, um, party dress. I saw like party dress. I thought someone was asking me about a party dress. There's one called party dress. No. See, I like those fun ones. Strawberry pound cake sold out online. Okay. Oh my God. That would, okay. So strawberry is red. So that would be one that I would probably love. I did not see that one. Oh man. So someone said, can you return them? You absolutely can. I've talked to Bath and Body Works employees if you light this, even if you use half of the candle and you still don't like it, you can take it back and exchange it for another one. I didn't know that. I mean, that's pretty amazing um, to be able to do that. Mahogany Teakwood, I have one of those at home. I love the scents that remind me of the smell of my husband. I'm crazy, but a lot of them are cologne type ones, and they remind me of my husband. I love those. Um Yes, you can return them and coupons. So if you have the Bath & Body Works app, any coupons that expire, they disappear out of the app. But if you have the actual physical um, coupons, you know, that you get in the mail or an email coupon and they've expired, they're good for three days. I really want to try that sugared blueberry now. Ain't going back in there because I'm telling you, the line was four times worse than when I um, got into the store. 950. So I saw the, I'm seeing the frugal comment, my um, ASMR friend there. Um, definitely not nerdy. You are awesome. Um, yeah, 950 seems like not frugal, right? These candles last a long time. I'm not one to like consistently light candles every day. I know people who wake up and they light their candles from start of day till end of day. I don't do that. I think for like a treat, I don't, the only time I buy Bath and Body Works is free coupons in the mail. Um, Semi-annual sale is my stock up time and candle sale, but normally I do the candle sale online. So this was my first in-store experience. I would definitely come back, but I would bring like someone to help me because it was a little overwhelming. So this is flannel. Has, oh my God, this just kind of smells like my husband. I love this. I love this smell. Um, mm, flannel smells good. Has anybody tried flannel? Let me know. They are, Amy. They, they really are. And you guys know me. I'm not a big shopper. Um, I never come to the mall very rarely unless I get like a Yankee Candle coupon or <laughs> free coupons. So once in a while, it's nice to treat yourself because guys, you deserve it. You deserve it. So this is just pretty. I love 
these jars. So this is winter candy apple. So I told you guys I love anything. Yes, sweater, weather, flannel. I think I got, I thought I got the sweater one too. Flannel smells amazing. So I'm super excited for that one. That will be a keeper. Um, this will probably be a keeper too. Winter candy apple. I love anything apple. It just smells so fresh, so good. I mean, again, reuse these jars at Christmas time. You know, you can put your pine cones in here and leave it open. Um, they are so reusable. You can put like nail polish in here. I haven't done this yet, but one of my thoughts is um, for next year, because I don't have any Christmas candle, but I'm going to keep these and re-gift them with like um, nail polishes. So I hope that they fit here I don't know if they're going to be too tall and not fit in here, or I can make like a little nail polish kind of like gift set. So that'd be really awesome. And of course people would have to pull up and be watching me now. All crazy. Okay. These, oh my gosh, these are just so cute. So this one is London tea and biscuits. Look at it. How cute that is. And yeah, guys, you can shop online. So if you don't have a Bath and Body Works near you, definitely do the online shopping. If you don't like crowds, definitely do the online shopping. If you don't like being hot, definitely do the online shopping. I had my hair like it had some, like it was looking, it was a good hair day. You know, when you have a good hair day, I got out of there. I was sweating bullets. Um, what does it smell like? It smells like, honestly, if anyone has, um, use this candle. This is the first thing that I thought of when I smelled this in store, bazooka bubble gum. It smells like bubble gum to me. Um, let me know what you think. Um, it has iced lemon, love it, sugar crystals, buttery shortbread with essential oils. It smells like, like bubble gum. That is exactly the first like scent. So is anybody um, lit the London here. Not a good day to take your kids. It, it is not with the strollers. The thing with my store is, Lisa, they were um, like taking count of not, I mean, they didn't have an exact count of how many people in there, but they weren't overwhelming it too much in store. So it wasn't too unbearable. Um, so that was the nice thing. Yes, I went at 70 and it was so cramped. Yes, don't wear heavy coat. I was just like, I wasn't in there that long, but I was just thinking, gosh, I don't want to, <laughs> to want to be here because it was so hot. Um, but this one, I haven't seen anyone who's London. Did anyone, has anyone um, had the London candle? It smells like hubba bubba or whatever the bubble gum is. It's, it, that's what it reminded me of. And I haven't had that gum since I was a kid. So I guess it was the nostalgia that like made me buy this candle. It smells so good though. It smells fun, you know? Okay, peppermint twist. You gotta get a traditional, um, oh yeah, some people are saying that they love that scent. Peppermint twist there smells really good. Yep, your typical little peppermint candle there. And, oh my God, this one is so pretty, Ski Lodge. Look at how the top looks like the snow. Again, guys, these are so reusable. I don't care if I got a gift that said Bath and Body Works and someone made something really cute for me. I am not picky like that. I think that's amazing when you can reuse something. Um, I'm gonna tell you how much in just one second. We're almost done, actually. This one, Ski Lodge, it's hot cocoa. It's hot cocoa and cream. It smells 100% hot cocoa. Um, majority reason why I got this is this jar is everything. Isn't that just beautiful? just beautiful and yes it's hot cocoa 100% guys we got one more so the last one I got oh I did good I got a sweater weather I thought I grabbed one of these this one smells this is another husband candle it smells like my man loved it um yeah so pretty with the snowflakes too all right guys so that was everything that I got so I am gonna go ahead and show you my receipts you know, it might be okay to actually go later. I know a lot of people were saying like after work. Oh, and the other thing that I had too was that free um, body product coupon. This is going to go in my stocking, Paula. I don't know if Paula is here in the live. If you are, shoot a comment so I can thank you for this. But this is going to go into my daughter's um, stocking. So it's um, a free bath 
um, product up to $13, I believe. Most of the stuff is over $13. So this is $12.50. You can get this for free. So let me dig out my receipt. And I guess for getting two trays, you get like this reusable bag, guys. Um, most people were getting the paper ones, but I noticed that they were just buying one tray. Oh, I saw, I saw a comment. If that was you, Paula, I'm sorry. Sam will love it. Sam is such a Bath and Body Works gal. Um, so my total was $117.40. Yes, that's crazy. But at least half of these are going to be regifted. Well, you know, they're gifts. Um, and I saved, well, I used a $50 Ibotta. I was saving that Ibotta for this sale. So I used a $50 gift card. So I paid $67.40 cash. Um, oh, you got the bag and you only got six candles. At my store, it was only if you had like double trays, they were giving you that bag. Um, people were asking for the bag though, but they were getting, if you were just getting six or less candles, you were getting the paper bags. Online, the price is $9.50. Yes, you can grab them online, guys. Definitely grab them. I'm super excited. Um, probably the mint chocolate I will regift because I'll keep that um, ski lodge because I love the jar way better. Yeah, stores opened way too early. There was no way I was getting here that early. Um, I could have used it on a candle holder, yes, but I have enough candle holders, honestly, and I could have. You are so right. I wanted to use it and get a stocking stuffer for my daughter because I don't need any candle holders. Um, but I could have, and I could have used it as a gift. You're right. But I wanted to get something for my little Sammy. So, um, yeah, that is kind of what I did there and put that together for her. Let me just click out of that. I got a email there, um, an energy lotion. Ooh. So yeah, don't forget your bags. Don't forget your bags guys. Cause for your gifts, that is awesome to just have those. They look so stinking cute. But um, yeah, if you haven't gone yet, I would say don't worry about it. If you're working, go after work. I don't think it'll be crazy. Um, you'll probably miss the madness. Online, you could stack the coupons. Some stores open at four, yes. Yeah. Some stores open at one. I saw some people online waiting in line like at midnight. I'm like, oh my gosh. Not going because of no coupons. Oh no, Lisa. Check your email. Double check your email. Yes, Stephanie, the stores are super well stocked. That's what I have to say. And they had so many employees in there just restocking. So I think they're, they always have their game on every sale. They are awesome. Um, I think they're doing awesome this year as usual. You can ask for a 20% off. How do you get the 20% off? I think that was in an email. I checked my email before I got in store because I was going to break up my transactions if I couldn't use like the coupons and things like that. Um, but I was able to use the free product coupon and the, I think it was 15 off of 40. It was the mailer coupons. Oh my goodness, guys. And thank you. I got two Christmas cards already. We love Christmas cards, so I'm going to be hanging these up. Um, this is from Shantae. If you are here, girl, thank you. And then this one is from Shelly B. I love Christmas cards. I love them. So thank you so much. 20% um, on hand soap yesterday. Yes, I love me some Christmas cards. They are all, I tape them with good old scotch tape on the like our closet doors or anywhere I can those cards every card I get it goes up somewhere and a lot of people don't send cards so anymore it's kind of like you know an old tradition but I love old traditions you can use it three days yes the coupons you can use three days after they are expired so hopefully you guys have those email coupons and you can use them Memphis one o'clock crazy Ask about a mil. Okay, so military, ask about the military discount. You should definitely get a discount. So ask for that. But yeah, guys, I wanted to jump on, share what I got. They are super stocked. Um, I guess some of the really hot ones, like that strawberry, I can't remember what it was. Oh, they have gift boxes. I didn't know that. I didn't know that. Shoot. 
Um, okay, so ask for gift boxes too. But um, there were a lot of sweet people. I actually met an older man in there. He was buying them for his daughters. He was so stinking sweet. Made my day. Really just made my day. Oh, Unicorn Sparkles. That would have been awesome to get. I did not see that one either. See, that's the hard thing with curing your own candles. You really can't see as much as you want to see. Thank you, Miss Monica. So I found out from you guys that if you thumbs up a video, you just have to exit out of the chat and it's going to take you to the screen where you can thumbs it up. So I know that now whenever I'm watching a live video that that is what I have to do. So I was telling you guys, you got to get out of the video and come back in the video, which is nonsense. You shouldn't have to do that. But I wasn't sure with YouTube. So thank you, Monica. But yeah, guys, do you have any questions or anything about deals? I'm um, CVS video is posted. I'm going to go home. I'm actually going to get my newspapers now, and then I'm going to go home, and I'm going to work on Walgreens. So I'll have Walgreens posted today for you guys. And um, yeah, all that good stuff. Unicorn sparkles, oh, a sweet smell. See, I like a sweet smelling candle. So that would have been one that I would have gotten. My daughter would have loved that one. I think she's going to love the one with the llama on it. Um, Walgreens looks pretty good this week. So definitely uh, my Walgreens couponers get into Walgreens tomorrow. I didn't, I think the last two weeks I didn't do a Walgreens haul video because I didn't need anything. It was kind of a crumb couple of weeks. Oh, they go down to 70 or $70. Hello. $7 with the percent off. Where did I put my receipt? Was so excited about my, um, Christmas cards. I can't wait to hang them up. Thank you. Um, I can never read these receipts. They are so crazy. Well, mine, because I got so many, it was showing them $1.16 off of the $9.50. So it wasn't as cheap. And I didn't have the 20% offer. I would have used that for sure because that would have been more off of my total. So 20% off coupon is awesome, guys. How many candles did I get? I got 13 candles. 13, 13. Um, I'm gonna get the newspapers and I'm gonna try and post my preview early. I know these past couple of weeks, it's been one week I didn't even put it up because we had so much stuff going on. Today is a slow day. We're gonna be doing stockings. I'm super excited. So we're gonna be making the mom stockings for my Christmas event. I keep saying my Christmas event. I don't know. I don't know how to put it. Um, so we're going to be making, not the stockings. We're going to be making the gift baskets for the moms. So I got the hat and scarf sets. I really wanted to get them each a candle. But, um, you know, with a candle, I don't know if, like, they really want candles lit there for safety reasons. So I stayed away from the candles. But um, we've got other, like, personal care items and all of that the stuff that I showed from the Dollar Tree, like the um, fuzzy socks, the little, oh my God, someone gave the most amazing idea to include like a quote in those little planner books that I got. So what I'm going to do, I, I wish I had like really great handwriting because I would actually write something, but I am going to um, print out like a quote and tape it in each of the books on the hardcover on the inside. I think that is going to be awesome. I'm super, super, super pumped to do this stuff, guys. Do that holiday stuff. Like, do all that fun holiday stuff. Um, oh, my gosh. We watched Bozo Circus yesterday. Are any, do you, any of you guys remember? I'll give you a shout out. I can't. I, I just. Oh, okay. Bye. Um, they, um, they had Bozo Circus on. Do you guys remember that with like the grand prize? Okay. Yeah. The grand prize game. Do you guys remember that? That was crazy. Crazy. Buy three, get three on body care. They're still having that. Okay. That is a good sale for sure. Oh my gosh. Your sister was on that, Amy. That is crazy. Oh, please. Okay. Okay. Yes. Oh my God. It was so fun. And then what do we see the other day at Charlie Brown Christmas, which is, you know, traditional in our family. We love that. 
Um, I hope it comes on again. It was really, I mean, it was like from the 60s. So it was like so, bef my, my son was like, mom, did you watch this then? I'm like, okay. I wasn't, I think it was like 68. They were showing some of like the, um, the uh, just the different things that they did and I, from when I watched it it was way different um but it was so neat to see and he was so my son was so like engrossed in it he really enjoyed it so that was fun but I remember Bozo never went to you know the Bozo show um hi Laura good morning but it was so it was so crazy how different um the bozo was like from early on from the bozo that I like the way he talked, the way he sounded, it was crazy, but that was fun. So yeah, watch, there's a ton of Christmas stuff on. Um, there was another Christmas movie with, um, with Leah Michelle. I didn't see that one. I wanted to see that. I think that was right after, um, Charlie Brown that day. And I didn't watch that Christmas show. I watch every Hallmark show. Um, what were the most recent ones? Christmas at the Plaza. I love that one. That was good. I love them all. Some of them are cheesy, but I love them. That's the most recent that I saw, I think. That was like last week, actually. Um, hazelnut somewhere. Yes. Oh, you guys are talking there. But yeah. We are doing all of that holiday stuff because, guys, it's going to be gone before we even know it. So soak it all in. Enjoy it. Don't let it, you know, not be around because you're going to miss it, especially with kids. Oh, my gosh. You know what, Miss Magical Monica? Can I make you? I do have moderators, but I'm going to make you a moderator if you're fine with that. You let me know in the um, after when I, get, when I get home, I'm going to go through the chat and I'm going to add you as a moderator. And if there's anyone else that is interested, you know, just to watch those comments that are just like, come on, we don't need you. We don't need you here. Thank you, my friend. You are amazing. Um, she, I see, I didn't even see, oh yeah. I seen a couple comments with a, a non-invited guest. But yeah, guys, I think I'm going to go ahead and grab those newspapers. I don't think they'll sell out today. There's nothing super exciting. Um, I hope you guys have an awesome day, as always. I will be up early tomorrow. Yeah, people can be disgusting, right? They're just crazy nasty. I mean, gosh, there's there's too much to do, like, to, like, worry about being rude to people. That's one thing today. Everybody was super nice in store. I mean... I know we're all tired of standing in line and you know we want to smell our candles and all of that crazy stuff but just be kind because kindness makes everything so much better and Amy too Amy can I make you a moderator as well if you're fine with it it just means like when a nasty comment comes out you just you just kick them to the curb you just slam them out of here um, you have a magical day, my friend. So I'm going to go ahead and sign out, go home to the kids. I will have the coupon insert preview up so you guys can check it out. Next week, no coupons. So keep that in mind. And then the following week, no coupons. So we got a break. I love a break. Um, so yeah, definitely you guys. Oh, okay. I, I see. Oh my gosh. Okay. Anywho, you guys have an awesome day. Enjoy your day. Love you guys. Thanks for the holiday cards. I appreciate them. I appreciate you guys. And thank you, Paula. I didn't even see Paula in this. And Leave a comment. Maybe she did. Thank you so much for making my candle day a little bit easier. And um, yes, I will see you guys later.